We're going to look at some examples now where the graphs are already done for us. State the slope in the equation for the graph line. And we'll want to go back if we have questions about these and look at the um, two sentences or rules that we wrote, which was this one, all vertical lines have undefined slope and our x equals a number. And all horizontal lines have zero slope and our y equals a number. All right, so number five is a vertical line. And a vertical line was the statement above, which is that the slope was undefined. And a vertical line comes in the form x equals, and the x number is 2. Notice that it x equals is a vertical, even though the x-axis is horizontal. So this is going to be backwards. Next one is horizontal. That means that the slope is 0, and the equation is y equals 6. Again, backwards, it's y equals 6, even though the y-axis is vertical. Feel free to pause the video, or even um, rewind the video, or maybe try some of these in a second on your own. This one's horizontal. So the slope is 0. Think of the slope birdhouse, and it's y equals negative 4. There's that y value. Number 8 is undefined. Should also make a note, although we don't have to, I suppose, but it is vertical, which means it's x equals, and the x number is 0. Number 9 is horizontal, and the rule was slope is 0, and the equation is y equals 5, 6, 7, 8. y equals 8. No x's. Number 10, this one's a vertical. So the slope is undefined, and the equation is x equals negative 3. All right, before we go on to the next two, in fact, the last two, I would suggest pausing it and trying these two. All right, hopefully you tried these. This one is vertical, which means the slope is undefined. And the equation is x equals 10. And the last one in this batch is horizontal. And it's y equals 0.